Hello everyone. Today class we see two implementation of up down counter using VSGL. Okay, this is the symbol of up down counter and two table of the up down counter. So if reset is one and enable clock and up mode selecting the mode and output and this is the up um, white color label is the for up counter and pink color label is for down counter so 0, 0, 2, 1, 1 is the up counter and 1, 1, 2, 0, 0 is the down counter we want to select which one we need ok so already I have developed the code so I give the explanation of the code this is the library functions because we are going to use plus and minus so we want to give assign and arithmetic one after that a number 0 to number triple one zero zero like that and clock load reset direction output so direction is whether zero means we are going to do increment what means we are going to do decrement up down and number will be loaded in temp and we call the temp to output ok this is a simple code for up down counter using if and else statement after finish the when we want to check check syntax so in syntax if there is any error means it will show otherwise it will come green tick next we want to check the RTL schematic This is RT thematic for the counter. Okay, up down counter. Next technology thematic. So this is the technology thematic. If each inside, if you see means you will see logic gates and mux and buffer and all. And after we check thematic and uh, thematic diagrams, next we want to check the faint summary. Here we just want to see. how much LUTs we are using, how much flip-flop we are using, how much clock buffer we are using, how much input output buffer we are using like that and we want to check the delay ok so total 2.83 nanosecond like the delay we want to check after completion of area and the delay analysis we go for the power distribution that one check in the Zeiling's power analyzer So the dialing power analyzer will be in place and root section. Okay, that will be shown in dialing power analyzer window. Now present root is running. So now styling per analyzer window is opening. So we are using 0 0.060 watt. And next we check the simulation window with two table whether if two table output is coming or not. Just give the number that one load triple one four one I am giving let's give the clock so initially I am giving zero one and hundred then this is the time period after we want to load so just to give one after that just to give the reset one to check working or not next give zero and check so main one is we want to give direction going for up or down so whether they give 
one and q t set zero and c see the code if one means we're going to do decrement right Already I load the number triple one, so now I'm clearing the one. So if you check means from one one two it get decreasing. Next we check for increment zero. So zero to triple one. So we did the output similar to two table. Okay. So we developed code for the up counter and down counter and combine the code up down counter. Okay. So we check power area and delay and also RTO semantic and technology semantic and also we check the simulation window with truth table also we check and verify the output okay thank you